Hey guys, I'm gonna try to make this video as brief as possible. Um, it is the new year. So happy new year, welcome 2013. Um, I expect all types of great and wonderful things to happen this year. If you can tell, the background's a little bit different. I'm actually at the apartment, and my voice is probably going to be echoing because I have, like, no furniture in the living room. Um, I also look a mess today, so excuse me. I've just been running around. I've had a really long weekend. My mom got sick. Um, my dad had some things to do. I took a, a test. I've been chilling with Liam all weekend, so it's just, it's been a long, long weekend. Anyways, I'm going to get right down to it. I've got about two weeks worth of updates for you. I made a video last week, never got the chance to edit it and post it. So, um, last Sunday, which I believe was the 30th, the 30th I weighed in at 287.6. And today, this Sunday, I'm going to show you guys, I weighed in at 285 even. So, um, I just think that I'm really happy with that progress. I've lost about two and a half pounds in um well from one week to the next so in about a week and i'm happy with that um i did do my measurements and because my weight was up to 287 i was up a little bit which i didn't like um my arms were 17 so bicep 17 chest was 47 waist was 43 it used to be 42 and a half hips were 54 which have gone up an inch and thighs were 29 which have stayed the same so my workout goals for the week were to get four times in um this past week i got I believe twice, two or three times, and the week before that I only got twice. Um, so starting in starting this month, starting next week, I'm actually going to be working out structured about four times a week, and I'm gonna try to get that up to five times a week so that that'll be four times working out between class and my YMCA class, and the fifth time will be me working out by myself. So that's Get Fit Club, which will be Mondays and Wednesdays for me, Pilates, which will be Tuesdays and Thursdays, and then Couch to 5K will be Tuesdays and Thursdays right before Pilates. Um, so Fridays, I'm either going to try to do the school gym or do the YMCA class of TRX. Um, what else? So with eating, I have decided to try the Paleo-inspired plan. I'm going to put a link to that in the box underneath. Um, my former personal trainer, Diane who has her own business, Curvy Goddess Lounge, Curvy Goddess Workout um, in New York City. She's awesome. She's a plus size personal trainer who caters specifically to plus size women and also just getting women back into a healthier lifestyle. She's amazing. I started working out with her when I still lived in New York. Was this 2000? I think it was 2011. It was 2011 I started working out with her and I've known her since then, so about two years now. And she's an amazing person and it's really awesome to see her business grow and take off. Um, so with the plan, it's just no grains and no legumes. That has been so much harder than I thought. I've gone a couple of days without, and I actually did see my skin clearing up. Like today I have no makeup on. I do have some acne scarring left. I've been, my face has been crazy and breaking out lately, but the couple of days that I did no grains, I did feel better. I didn't feel like as heavy, if, if that makes any sense. And I just, you know, I felt pretty good overall. Um, what else? So I've got some mini goals for some things that I have coming up. I have um, a New York City Plus Model Network casting that's coming up January 26th. So by the 26th, I want to be another eight pounds down. So I'd like to be really, 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 I'm trying to get out of the 280s. I'm so tired of saying 280 anything. So I'd like to be 279. So I've got another six pounds to go to reach that goal. Full figured week, um, excuse me, full figured fashion week casting in Atlanta is going to be February 9th. And my goal by then is to be down about 14 or 15 pounds. By the end of May, I'd like to be down 30 pounds total and hoping that will put me at, um, a goal at my goal of being a size 18. Um, I want to thank all the new people that subscribed. I'm up to 51 subs now and I'm excited about that. I'm at 51. It's like, nothing I don't care though but I'm really glad that you know people have subbed to my channel and that you guys are watching and that you guys are still following my progress I really appreciate that um so what else is going on with me um I'm gonna be working on a vision board which I will probably share with you guys um I'm gonna try to have that done like this week is gonna be actually the calmest week I have before school starts again I start school back on the 14th but I'm taking a CNA class um, online currently so I'm studying for that but I'm going to try to do my vision board, share that with you guys. So it's going to be my vision for myself as a mom to get fit as a model, just any of the other career things that I have going on. Um, and some of my weight loss journey goals that I'd really like to accomplish this year, or I'm going to, you know, give myself a timeline, like just accomplish soon. 
Um, the 60 pounds, another 60 pounds lost on top of the 40 something I have now. So my, remember if you guys, I think see my, one of my original videos, my original goal was to lose 108 pounds and, um, I'm about 60 pounds away from that. Again, I might stop at like 98 or I might stop at 90 pounds loss if I feel comfortable at that weight and that size. But as of now, my goal is still to lose 108 pounds total. So I've got 60 more to go. Um, I would like to also become a group fitness instructor, whether that be at the YMCA or another health club. I think that'd be really awesome. Something like Pilates or a circuit training class, I'd really have fun doing. Um, my goal by the end of this year is also to be a size 16, a, a toned and fit size 16, mind you. And also to, as often as possible, work out five times a week. So I'm definitely going to work on that and really, really changing my diet. Like not diet as in something you do temporarily, but changing my diet as in what I consume, what I take in inside of my body. I'm going to try to get better about feeding both me and Liam, both organic and, um, what do they call free range <laughs> food like I just know it's better for us and I'm really gonna try to lay off the processed food as much as possible it's gonna be it's gonna be a challenge um financially because you know and in terms of time because we all know that processed food is cheaper and it's also more convenient than eating healthy but convenience is not always where it's at um so that's really all the updates I have for you guys I don't know what week this is gonna be so I'm gonna call this this is weight loss journey. This is year one, month five. I can't believe. Wow, it's almost been a year and a half. That is crazy. That is really crazy. So you guys remember I started August 2011 and here we are in January 2013. So it's been a year and a half. And you know, my weight loss has come off slow, but I'm really happy with my progress and that at least I'm getting healthier and now I'm back on track to losing weight. So hopefully the next time I have an update for you guys, I'll be another one or two pounds down and closer to my goal of 279. And thank you guys again for watching. Thank you for subbing. I wish everyone a, um, I hope you guys had a happy holiday and I wish you a happy new year. And I will, again, put the link for the plan in the bottom and I'll put the link to my blog in case you guys want to see some other stuff. I, some, I sometimes do more blogging than I do vlogging. So um, thank you guys so much for listening and I will see you guys next week. Bye.